What up there, folks? <clears throat> James Stillwell here, Open Air Atheist. Uh, I'm making this video as kind of an update. I'm sorry I haven't posted a video on this channel in a little bit, um, but I've been really busy. I recently moved to uh, Cary, North Carolina. Um, so, yeah. Uh, so I'm out here kind of on the outskirts of the woods. Uh, I've been here in uh, staying with my sister in uh, North Carolina now for a couple days. I got here on Monday. I think it's what Wednesday today. Um, so it's it's beautiful out here. I'm actually from the East Coast. I'm from Jersey area, New York City, Jersey area, and uh, so yeah. So it's good to be out here on the East Coast where there's more trees and stuff because. Where I was at in Cali, there wasn't trees like there is here. Uh, it's really nice. I found a nice little kicket spot um, by this tree. Let me show you. Really kind of digging this tree. Nice tree to sit under. Got a nice little butt rest there. Uh, I got my coffee, my green mug. I got my uh, bug out bag, as I call it, my army backpack. Um, and uh, in case you're wondering what that handle is, that's actually a, a tomahawk handle. Uh, I have a tomahawk in my bag, <laughs> and I'll get that. I'll get to that here in a second. Why I have a toma tomahawk in my bag? You're probably wondering why. Why does this guy? this weird atheist dude have a tomahawk in his back. Uh, so anyways, I plan on doing a uh, series called ABC, and it's Atheist Bushcraft. So, <laughs> uh, it's going to be where I uh, show, like, you know, survival wilderness um, skills, you know, like how to make a fire or debris hut or whatever um, in a survival situation in the woods. Um, so, yeah, so ABC stands for Atheist Bushcraft. I don't know why I'm going to call the series that. Uh, I, I don't know, I guess I just am. So, uh, yeah. So anyways, um, I plan on going to Umstead National uh, park, which is just a couple miles from here at some point, uh, probably this weekend, I'm not really sure, and, uh, yeah, and then I'll probably, you know, show you guys how to make fire and stuff, uh, I'll be bringing my Vietnam tent with me, um, and my bag, of course, and a few other supplies, uh, so that'll be interesting. So I just kind of needed a break from the, uh, you know, refutation videos and, uh, that I've been making on my Open Air Atheist channel. Uh, it's over 150 videos now of pretty much this non-stop refutation, and I kind of need a break. Um, so, I, I don't know, I've been kind of cooped up in the house uh, back in Cali for like a year. I didn't go out, maybe a little bit over that. Um just been like debating people on Skype and comments and uh, Facebook and you know different internet outlets uh, and I kind of just you know like I said already a million times I need a break <laughs> um, and I really like the outdoors so so yeah so I think the video first video I'll do in the series is just gonna be on what kind of tools I bring with me uh, into the wilderness um, and the tomahawk is one of those. And actually, um, you know what, I'll, I'll go ahead and make this the first, uh, episode in the series. And I'll show you this tomahawk that I have. So, hold on a second. I'm using my iPad, so, sorry if the video quality is not that, you know, not that good. Uh, but I'm using the iPad, the second generation. And, uh... So let me show you this thing I got. So 
so I got this Tomahawk online. Uh, it's, it seems to be pretty cool. I mean, it's pretty well made. Uh, this is a cold steel Tomahawk. Hope you can see that well. Uh, it came pretty damn sharp, actually. Uh, I've been watching a lot of reviews on this here on YouTube on this particular Tomahawk. This is the cold steel um, Trailhawk. It's not very big. It's I'll back up from it actually. It's pretty light. Uh, you can actually watch a lot of reviews on this. Just type in Cold Steel Tomahawk uh, Trailhawk and uh, yeah you can watch some pretty good uh, reviews on this. It's a pretty good throwing Tomahawk. Um, it chops pretty well. I, From what I've seen in the videos I haven't actually chopped anything with it yet uh, but I will probably later on in, in this series that I'm doing. Um, probably will you know show how to you know how it chops and stuff so I'll do a little review on this um, at some point um, so but yeah it's it's good it's it's balanced uh, I haven't thrown it yet but I like I said if you go and watch the video reviews on this you can see that it's it's actually pretty fairly easy to throw uh, I just I don't want to throw it at these nice trees or anything and I haven't found anything around here to throw it at yet uh, just kind of got out here it was raining for a while um, so yeah but I, I really like it it's, uh, it's pretty sturdy it's got a nice nice handle here um, only thing is uh, I went ahead and popped the pin out it comes with a set pin uh, I don't know if you could see that but I uh, I pulled that out and just screwed it out with the Allen key um, because this is a tension fit tool so you're supposed to be able to um, I can't do it right now because it's really on there but um, once I get that loosened up and, and uh, actually do some work on the edge there um, I'll be able to just go like that it'll slide down the handle so if the handle breaks for any reason uh, you know you can just make another one right there on the spot and there's a lot of good uh, bush crafting, um, you know, tasks that you can, uh, survival tasks that you can perform with this little baby. Uh, great for nailing uh, tent pegs uh, and other stuff. So it's got the little hammer there in the back. Um, this thing will actually go through a car, uh, a hood of a car, and uh, not doll up too bad. So uh, this is a pretty sturdy, uh, pretty, pretty sturdy steel here. Uh, that the head is made out of. So, uh, I like it so far. Like I said, I haven't really tested it out too much, but I will um, test it out in the future. I just didn't see the need to do that in this video because, like I said, there's already a lot of good reviews on this uh, Tomahawk. So, check those out. Um, so, yeah, I was just here kind of enjoying the nice air. Let me show you this field here. This field actually quite a quite a, few, quite a lot of deer out here um, can't see them right now um, yeah it's a real beautiful area woods goes way deep back in that direction pretty much in all directions here except for over there uh, great camping out here in NC a um, lot of it's just gorgeous here uh, I really missed the East Coast I've been out in Cali for about 10 years and uh, I'll tell you what, man. <sighs> Just great air out here. Um, I did run into a torrential downpour. It's kind of crazy here for a little bit. We had a thunderstorm going on, and I got a little bit wet. Um, but other than that, weather is pretty nice here. It doesn't seem to make up its, you know, seem to want to make up its mind, and uh, it'll rain and it'll be sunny. And... But other than that, man, I'll tell you what. I'm digging it here. Uh, everything's pretty spread out. I don't have a car, so that kind of sucks. Um, but I do have a mountain bike, and they do have a lot of greenways around here. Uh, so that's cool. Anyways, I don't want to ramble on and make this video longer than it already is, so I'll get back at you later. Thanks for watching.